Now that your Shopify store is up and running with hot selling dropshipping products and you learn how to run Facebook ads to promote your products the right way, now it's time to learn how to fulfill the orders that you are finally getting from your customers. So now that you're connected to AutoDS, every time you get an order from one of your customers, it will show up here on the dashboard and then you can click on orders here or on the left side to be taken to the orders page. Each and every order that you will get on your Shopify store, you will see it over here on the orders page as you see in front of me. Now, there are a few ways to fulfill your orders. The first way is manually. Every time you get an order, log on to your supplier site, buy the product and enter your customer's shipping address. Send the product to your customer and that is done. On AutoDS, the first status will be pending. Then you will have to move it manually to ordered and supply your buy order ID that you're getting from the supplier and then click on update. Once you do that and you click on update, the order will change from pending to ordered. Once you get a tracking number, move it to shipped, write down the tracking number over here and the shipping carrier. And that is how you can process the orders manually and update the order statuses accordingly. So one way is doing it manually. The second method is using the AutoDS automatic order service. What this means is AutoDS will use your buyer accounts from your supplier sites and the system will buy the product automatically using your payment settings from your buy account. The system will simply order the product from your supplier directly to your customer. It will automatically update the statuses as you see down here with the order number and ship with the tracking number, which means you are getting automatic tracking updates and everything is pretty much automated for you. You won't have to process your orders by yourself. AutoDS will take care of it. So this is a very, very fast service for your customers to get their products quick. And if you want more help on how to sign up for the AutoDS auto ordering service, just use the resources PDF that we have for this course. I'll put the links over there to the help center on our website that will take you step by step in this process. But to show you really quick, just go to the settings in the plans and add-ons. Make sure that the orders processor is turned on. Then on the buy accounts on the right side, make sure to create a buyer account using the supplier that you would like to have the auto ordering process from and fill in the rest of the details. More information on that, once again, in the resources PDF that you have for this course, you have the links to all of the help articles to get this started. Now, if you want to see if your order was processed automatically, you will see a lightning icon that looks like this. And that is how you will know that AutoDS automatically processed this order for you. So once again, that's the second method to process your orders. And the third method to process your orders is by using the fulfilled by AutoDS service. The difference between automatic orders, which I just talked about a minute ago, to fulfilled by AutoDS, which is what I'm going to talk about now, is that on automatic orders, you have to supply your own buyer accounts from your suppliers, which means you're going to your supplier site, you're creating a buyer account, and you're giving AutoDS the buyer account information so that they can log into your buyer account and buy the products using your payment details. On the other hand, if you're using the Fulfilled by AutoDS service, in this case, AutoDS will use their own buyer accounts, which means they will not be using your payment information, and all of your orders will be processed automatically as long as you have auto order credits and auto order balance. Let me show you exactly what I mean. Let's go back to the orders page. Here is the auto order credits. It doesn't matter if you're using the fulfilled by AutoDS or the automatic order service. Each automated order will cost you one auto order credit. In order to buy credits, just click on the buy credit button over here. And here you will see the prices. The more credits that you will buy, the more discount that you will get. So having auto order credits is a must for both auto order methods. And here you have the icon for the managed accounts balance. Managed accounts is fulfilled by AutoDS, it's the same thing. So once you fill in your balance over here by clicking load, AutoDS will automatically process your incoming orders and it will deduct the price from your account balance. And this is why it doesn't need to use your own buyer account. This is a really good service. A lot of people are using it, including me. It simply takes business automation to a whole new level. For more information on the Fulfilled by AutoDS service, once again, I put the help links in the resources PDF that you have for this course. Over there, you'll find information on how to opt in for the Fulfilled by AutoDS service or for automatic orders if you want to use your own buyer accounts. Either way, it's up to you. This is what automation is all about. 
Now, one more important thing that I would like to talk about when it comes to automatic ordering is once your tracking number is available, AutoDS will get the tracking number from your supplier and will automatically update the tracking number on the AutoDS platform. And at the same time, it will also update that tracking number on your Shopify platform. So this means that your customer will be notified that tracking number is available and they'll be able to track their packages and you didn't have to do a thing. AutoDS took care of all of this for you. So automatic orders is going to save you a lot of time and we all know that time is money. It's all about business automation nowadays if you want to be able to scale and profit successfully and through automatic orders you can allow yourself that. That's it for this lesson on how to fulfill your orders. Once again, I remind you that in the resources PDF, you have help guides to everything that I'm talking about, step-by-step -step tutorials on how to get your accounts running for automatic orders, whether you want to go with manual orders or automatic orders or fulfilled by AutoDS. Either way, the system is going to simplify everything for you. And that is all for this lesson on how to fulfill your orders. You don't have any assignments for this lesson unless you have orders on your shop then obviously your assignment would be to go and fulfill them now and opt in for the automatic orders. I have a feeling that you're going to love it. So that's it for this lesson and I'll see you in the next lesson where you will learn how to manage your returns and refunds. Not a fun subject. You're not going to deal with this one too much, but it's important to know how to deal with returns and refunds when you are managing your business. See you in the next lesson.